Hello and good evening. Uh, this video is a response for uh, two posted videos by our friend, by friend CHS. The first topic I would like to share uh, personal experience on is the old ugly pipe. Uh, actually, your your video have encouraged me to reach out for my very first pipe. It's my grandfather pipe that I'm smoking now. It's been a long time since I smoked this one, and I'm keeping it uh, as a memory for the for the person who held it. Uh, actually, it's a really nice piece, uh, silver match, as I already mentioned. Uh, it have a leather cover. Uh, it is wearing out already, as you can see. Uh, yeah, but it still is a good smoke, and at least I have a detailed history about its previous smoke, smoker, uh, and that's what I really prefer about estate pipes, that I know whom using it. You know, it's like collecting users as well as collecting pipes uh, and I really don't consider estate pipes or old pipes are ugly but then because each pipe is handmade and then uh, it's a piece of art by itself so I'm happily smoking this one right now I'm smoking uh, uh, Peterson University Flake it's a really nice tobacco uh, as for the second comment, it's uh, about uh, pipe rotation. Pipe rotation is an essential thing, actually, that you should follow as a pipe smoker. Uh, as the many literatures I went through, uh, they mention usually uh, uh, one to two hour rest between each smoke. Um, Sometimes it do the purpose, uh, especially if it's non aromatic uh, pipe tobacco because aromatic pipe tobacco they tend to cause more moisture than than the normal ones and then it is harder to to cure the the wet heel inside the bowl uh, secondly uh, uh, as a matter of using pipes i prefer using at least two to three pipes a day and in the end of the day i'll just clean them polish the stems and then keep them for let's say about two to three weeks to rest down really you know? that, and that's that's a, a time given for a pipe for my personal experience it's fairly enough to provide a next uh, good experience smoking experience so it uh, doesn't mean that you have to collect so many pipes and be a pipe maniac but then uh, it also refers to so many factors like how fast you can smoke your pipe and um, uh, what kind of tobacco you are using the smoking intervals uh, these are all factors that really affect the validity of pipe to be used in a short time but as a general tip pipe have to be rested between time to time to give it time to uh, evaporate all the residues that being absorbed by the by the bowl uh, to give you a nice long lasting uh, smoke thanks for watching uh, see you again